OK, we're back with 1.7. Using software on your computer, find out what colours would be represented by the following RGB denary value combinations. RGB obviously meaning red, green, blue, as we can see here. So I'm going to go to some software. Um, and then it looks like we've got to convert each of the above denary numbers into hexadecimal. OK, fair enough. We'll do one of them and then we'll check the answers. Let's have a look at the first one. If I go to something called rapidtables.com, as you can see there, rapidtables.com, and I type in the value for red, which we said was 53, and green, which was 55, and the blue, which was 139, and return that, we can see that the value a nice purpley blue color okay so that's red 53 55 or 139 um, and it's given as the x value there okay and um, the next one the next one would be just to, just to go through it we should have 201 a lot of, a lot of red nice pink glow there one, two, two, and four. Two, zero, four, and two. And here we go. We've got a lovely light purpley pink. And then finally, we had one, two. We had one, 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 and 81. Okay, and here we've got a darkened green color there. Okay, and then if we come back into this, I'll do the middle one, or grab a pen. Um, we've got red 201, and we need to convert that into a hexadecimal. So we'll start with that. So I'm going to go 1, 16. And none of these are higher. If we have a look, none of these have, have got a higher number than 256. So we've got to determine how many 16s go into each of these numbers, how many 1s go into the remainder of these numbers. So let's take a look. We've got, if we start with red equals 201. So how many 16s go into 201? Well, 12 times 16 equals 192. So I'm, I won't go any higher than that. So I'm going to say 12, which is A, B, C. Okay, so I've got C in there, and that is 192. So if we take those away from each other, we've got 9 left, so the answer must be C9. For the first one, I'll just put a little note down here, equals 201. The next one is 1, 2, 2, 7, so again 7 I believe, 7, 7 lots of 16 equals 112. So 7 times 1612, so we'll take that off to leave us with 10. So it would be, for this one, it would be 7. And 10 is obviously A, so that would be a value of 7A. So that equals 1, 2, 2. We have a value of 204. So 16s into 204, nine, 2, so we take that away from that, we have, so we've got C again, and then 192, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 again, so it would be C, C, equals 204. So there are our answers for B, you can see the first part we obviously did a bit of an investigation, and the second part... There we go. We have, I think I was right there, C9, 7A, CC. The first one is 35, 37, 8B, and C is C, 6F, 5, 1. Okay, that is it for now. Join us for 1.8. Thank you very much indeed.